Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. Today I have for you another haul. It's it's not just a Dollar Tree haul. I have from Dollar Tree, Dollar General, and Walmart. And without further ado, let's go ahead and let me dive right in. First I'm going to do the Dollar Tree. Now I, ne I don't remember seeing, this is called Frosty the Snowman. I've seen some snowman there before, but not the non-print. It's It has print on it, but it's so you can color it in if you want. It's just the outline, if you see. Um, let me open it. Now, they had the Frosty the Snowman, the uh, Peanuts and another i think it was snoopy in the, in with the peanuts and um one more i just can't remember which one it was so i have so much wrapping paper i, I almost wasn't going to get it but then my son talked me into it he said um you you don't have to color it i said i know that but um I've got so much. He said, even if we don't use it this year, it eventually get used. And he's right. But look at all the different poses that Frosty's doing. I just love him. I watch that Frosty the Snowman every year when it comes out. And, um, okay, this one, it had Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, too. I should have got it. But there's the snow, Frosty the Snowman. And then here is the Peanuts. And let's, let me open this one for you, too. It looks like it, it's for pretty. And just bear with me a minute to get this wrap off and look at all it's got the whole gang if you can see that I love it I think I like this one better than I do Frosty I, I try to watch all the cartoon every year at Christmas time that they come out with um the original ones like Frosty and um, Rudolph, uh, the Peanuts, and they they have so many of them. And uh, I'm just a big kid when it comes to watching these cartoons. <laughs> I'll go ahead and admit it. I'll admit it before anybody else can say it. I'm a big kid. Okay, and I've got some more gift bags. When I seen this, I said, I can't pass it up. Look at the train with Santa right there. And I think, let me see, yeah, he's waving. And I don't know. He's just on the caboose. Um, I believe that's what the part of the... And it's, it has a reef here and a tree here. And some bales on each side of the tree. And there's a... It doesn't say anything, you know, like Merry Christmas or nothing. But it says it all by itself just by looking at it. Look how gorgeous. Now, if you had a big enough picture frame or wood wood pieces to glue together or tack tack together as a nail with a little bitty nail in and then and use glue on the corners you can measure this out and get a poster board and um mod i wouldn't mod podge i would just cut this uh, side right here out and um down below where the hose are right here. That way you won't have the hose in it. And glue it 
onto the poster board with the and then put the the wood trim like a picture frame around it and it'll look like you have an expensive painting and just make sure you get some of that um, get some paint and, and paint the the frame and then get some of that um, it's wax from Walmart it's in, it's in with the little paints and just brush that over and sand it you know not sand it but wipe it over all, all around that way you can see some of the white coming in gives it, it get, gives it that um, vintage look and you'll have a real nice sharp looking picture that's just an idea I thought I'd share with you okay and then there, there's this it's candy canes Santa's favorite treat authentic fresh daily and handmade candy canes and little um sucker well um well they're candy canes and um the top is in glitter and the the bottom i don't know if the okay the candy canes are not in glitter but you could do the same thing with this with an eight by ten picture frame just um get your glass lay it on top of this and make sure you cut under the hose here that way it won't it won't be in the photo and you'll have a nice picture to hang on your wall and then there's this one when i seen this i thought this is the most beautiful bag that I have seen. It's, look how simple the background is. And look at that snowflake. It's just gorgeous. And I didn't show the sides to the other ones. And this one on the sides, it's blue with snowflakes. Let me, let me get the candy cane one. I'll show you the sides of it. Oh, it's got little candies. And then it's red and white stripes. Looks gorgeous on it. Okay, and I have one more bag. This one is, look how shiny the sleigh and the deer is, Santa in the air, and the tree right here is. It looks good. It's like gold, and the background is, it's real dark, and look at the, the, um, my mind went blank, um, snowflakes and stars, and then look at the reflection back here in the back. It, it's like a, two more trees standing farther back. But look how gorgeous they are. It's beautiful. It's real elegant. Just like the the snow the snowflake one. It, it's real elegant looking. And the sides is a bunch of Christmas trees. These are real beautiful. They've they come out with a lot of different gift boxes and gift bags this year. And now this says let it snow with with the snowman and he's like a 3d effect he's glued on there and now they had another one called um each letter was a different like one was i think it said merry christmas and um it had like for an r it had like elf feet and then they had one um, with Santa, but either either one way that you go with these, you can't go wrong. They've got like three to choose from. And before they, uh, about three weeks ago, they came out with one that was gnomes. Each letter of welcome 
was a different known. So really there's four different of these signs if you can find them. But I decided um, to get this one to go in my kitchen with my snowman. And I picked this up to go with, um, to go with, to go for um, cookies and muffins. And I think this will look real good when we're having cookies to eat while we're watching a movie. And I have already have the uh, the coffee cup that you get in the little box. They have one with this design exactly the, the way it is here on the coffee mug and they have um it's the most wonderful time of the year it's a snowman they have gnomes and all kinds this year and the, in the movies they have this master z ip man legacy um my husband loves the uh, the series the ip man and my son found this and we thought this would be a a good movie to get him for christmas you can't beat it for a dollar and we've bought movies from them before and they work just like you went somewhere else and paid more money for them okay now i picked up two of these um Pounce tuna flavor, um, crunchy. The little treats for the kitties. We're gonna uh, make them a stocking too. We have it. I have it hanging over there with ours, and uh, we're just gonna put all of them, all six of the cats that we have in the same bag and uh they have these sport um, earphones it's uh, lightweight and comfortable it's just little earphones my son said he'd been looking for something like this and for a dollar it's worth trying out seeing if they're good or not okay let me Oh, there's something else in the bag. I found a blue and a black. These are from Jun Junter. It's a headband, that the kind that goes around your, your head like this. Here's the black one. And they stretch out pretty good. And then here's a navy blue one. And for a dollar, you can't beat it. I mean, it goes on like this. Let me take my glasses off. Okay, just... If you have jewelry on, just be careful. That way you don't get them tangled up in it. And you just wear them about like that. And that's that's what they look like. I wanted to go ahead and leave it on. Oh, that don't look bad at all. Okay, let's see. The rest is candy from the Dollar Tree for um, for some of the stockings. They have this Tootsie, Tootsie Rose for a dollar. Well, unless they went up. I don't know if they went up to a dollar twenty-five yet or not. Uh, no, my Dollar Tree here in Paris, Kentucky um, is still at a dollar. And then there's these um, Elm, Elmer chocolate, uh, premium chocolates. You get different chocolates in here. 
And here's the chocolates on the back. There's five different kinds. And we got some of this sweet and spicy trail mix. These are my sons. He's already we bought two of them, but he uh, already got into one. And it, he's the only one in the house that can eat these. Uh, it burn, They burn my lips and burn my tongue. Anything real spicy. And then here's some Thin Mints. And they also had this, um, I just call it a peanut row. And it's got this white cream inside it. And then around it, it has caramel. And I already ate that. I ate that in the car. But um, they're real good. And, the, and it's covered in peanuts. If You might know which one I'm talking about. I'll be getting another one when I go back up there. And um, I'll wait until I do the video. That way I can show y'all what it is. Let me just move this off to the side. Okay, that's it on the Dollar Tree. So now I'm going to take you to Dollar General. Okay, first I got this uh, Christmas colors uh, don't can't let's see it says Christmas I can barely see it Christmas calories don't count and it says fresh baked cookies that's it right there and it's a candle it was only five dollars I don't know how it's upside there I guess that's five dollars yeah, and it comes with two wicks. Oh, that smells real good. And I like I like the the uh, stripes on the candle. I think they had a bunch of other flavors too. They had or scents, not flavors. Um, they had cinnamon, and before I realized that that it was cinnamon, I because um, I just liked the color of the candle. I opened it up and took a big whiff, and oh my God, it went right, right to me because I'm allergic to cinnamon. <laughs> okay, and I picked up this this mug. It says "Meowy Christmas." How cute! I had to get it because the key cat and it's only two dollars and look how big that mug is too and it's red down inside and this is a dollar it's for a, a card or something jewelry card anything but I took these uh, surveys and I cashed out with Amazon gift cards as my uh, payment after I made it, made enough survey money. And um, you just write that once you uh, cash out by the next day or s somewhere around there, they'll um, get back with you with the, sur uh, with the um, gift card number. And um, I'm just going to write them down because I've got them $40 worth and put it in this and, and get a little label tag and put right here on it. And all he has to do on Christmas Day is get on Amazon and he likes Magic the Gathering cards. So I assume he'll um, buy Magic the Gathering cards with them. <laughs> but I seen that and I thought that that's just perfect. Look. Look how it opens. And for a dollar, you can't beat it. Okay. Now I have some ribbon to show you. There's this one. And it was $2. Um... With the, with the snowman on it. Look how gorgeous he is. He's just so cute. 
And then there's this one. It's a dot. No, it's two dollars, and it's just black and white, uh, plaid. And then there's white with snowflakes and red, and it was a dollar. And then here's clear with white snowflakes, and it's a dollar. And all these are two inches by nine foot. Or um, some of them are two, 2.5 inches by 9 foot. And then there's this one for a dollar. It's 2 inches by 9 foot. And it's just uh, red with glitter on it. And then let's see. I'm getting all the big ones out. I went ahead, these are a dollar, and this is 1.5 inch by 9 foot, and it says, um, it has your snowman, and it says let it snow, going around it, and then here's the same one, now this one is a 1.5 inch by 9 foot, um, and it says Merry Christmas going around it. And then there's all of these are a dollar each. Well, I bought two of the, um, I meant to just buy one, but what I don't use this year, I can use next year, I guess. And all these small ones which are five eighth of an inch by nine foot for a dollar. We've got this red and white. We've got white with little red pokey dots and red going around the edge. And then we have black and red and white rope. I bought two of them. And there's the red and white again, and the black one. All of that, let me move this out of my way so I can bring over the Walmart. Oh, well, I did have two more things from um, the Dollar Tree, but it's a 70, it's a 70, <laughs> it's 27 square foot aluminum foil, it's, it's real long, and then there is this extra color safe bleach, non-chlorine, and it, it's cotton linen scent, it, this, this is the bleach that's good you can put it on your colored clothes, and it, it works great. I've been using this and the other brand that they get in for years now. Okay, now, first I'm going to show you what we got for the kittens that and the, and the cats for Christmas. We got this... Um, Smarty Cat Skitter Critters. It has catnip in it, and I tell you, the, the kittens noticed it earlier, and when I went to move my cat, Daisy, she uh, hissed and growled at me, swiped at me, and bit me. Gently. She didn't draw blood or nothing, but she'd never done that, but she meant business. <laughs> But anyway, we got the, this, um, these little mice, and they have catnip in it, so be, if you find these, beware, you know, you might have some fun with it, with them, with your cats out of it. And then there is a 13 count Vibrant Life Variety Pack cat toys. There's like the little round shiny balls, the, the mouse. Look at, look at that one right there. It's just too cute. 
and then there's, um, I don't know what this is for, it's, it's got a, unless it's on one of these toys, because there's a rope, and maybe one of them that you dangle with, and this was only, um, like four dollars for all of these, and this one was around two dollars. And then we picked up some because I forgot I bought the I bought the treats at the dollar store and went to Walmart and picked up some more. But at least they they have it now for a while. And this is uh, Temptations. One is savory salmon flavor, and the other one is shrimp flavor. This is the salmon, and this is the shrimp, and it's uh, soft on the inside and crunchy on the out, and they're only a dollar seventy four, but at the uh, at the Dollar Tree they were a dollar. And let's see. And then we got three of these, which has two little dinners on it, and they were like seventy two cents. But it's Sheba, and this is the um, tuna flavor. This one is. And then they have the roasted chicken and the delicate white fish and tuna entrees. Um, and they had a bunch of other flavors, too. But these are the ones we decided on based on how... Sorry about that. I bumped the camera. Based on what our uh, cats and kittens eat, because they're real picky. Okay. I found some more of this uh, ribbon there. It was... Four ninety eight. It's the whole little bundle, and I found some of these bows and these ornaments. I love the snowflake, and they have glitter on them. And you know, there's something I I thought of as I was um, looking at these. There were there were dollar ninety eight for six of them. You could take this little hanger thing off, and you could get some um, a pair of earrings that you don't like, or you know just never wear, um, or go go to the store and buy you some of the the hooks. Um, like these here, they have that little hook thing that goes in and it, and it drapes down in the back and you could turn these into earrings for Christmas and you can wear them since they're snowflake you can wear them after Christmas too but um, I got two of these and I do think I'm going to include changing two of these into some earrings in one of the videos coming up this week so, if you're subscribed, I, I hope you uh, tune in and watch it. And if you're not subscribed, I hope you subscribe so you want me to see any of my future DIYs and hauls. And then I picked up, this was $2.48 for 10 bows. And the last three things... is some shirts I got this one for my son it is strike first and no mercy and strike hard it's from that kung fu um, kickbox whatever it's from the like the karate kid and 
the uh, kids are grown up now, and now there's um, a series called um, Kia Cobra or something like that. But it's it's based on uh, kickboxing and stuff, and that's what this shirt is. And uh, my, my son told me he liked it. So I went ahead and got it for him. And then I picked this one up for my husband. We all know who he is. And uh, you can't beat it. These shirts was only like seven, seven ninety eight a piece. Let me look. Not seven eighty eight. They were only seven eighty eight a piece. But I got that one for my husband. And the last item that I got was this one for my husband. It's Nirvana, that band. Alright, I want to thank you all for stopping by and checking out my haul. Um, I hope you found some goodies that you are going to go to the store and hopefully pick up some and if you like today's video go ahead and hit that like button it really helped my channel grow share the video with your friends that way to help get my video out there and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and hit that notification bell next to it that way you won't miss any of my future DIYs and haul videos until next time you all bye